Welcome to get database training guys. You are listening to SAF and this is the fifth tutorial of this video series. In this video, we are going to learn how to add comments in an SQL server script file. Comments are a part of the SQL code which will be added to the script file but ignored and refrained from execution. SQL server supports two types of comments, single line and multi line. What are single line comments? Two hyphens represents a single line comment. A line starting with two hyphens won't be executed by SQL Server. In the syntax, we see that this single line is starting with two hyphens. So this line won't be executed because it is a single line comment. Now, what are multi line comments? Forward slash asterisk and asterisk forward slash represents a multi line comments whatever you write within this block won't be executed by sql server and here is a syntax so here the whole paragraph will be commented because we have started the paragraph with forward slash asterisk and we ended this paragraph with asterisk forward slash so let's understand this with practicals so here in our script file there are three queries let's say by looking at it we can't figure out what is the purpose of each query. So in order to make a note of the use of each query or to add any explanation to it, we use comments in SQL Server. Now we know that single line comments starts with two hyphens. So I'm going to make a note here. The blur query is to create a database and this query will be used to switch a database and the last query here will be used to create a table. So by using comments, I can specify a note or explanation for the purpose of each query. And how to write a multi-line comment? So multi-line comment starts with forward slash asterisk and they ends with asterisk forward slash. Whatever you are going to write within this block will be considered as a multi-line comment so these are the two types of comments in sql server so that completes this video i hope you found this tutorial helpful should you have any queries feel free to drop us a line also visit our website to access many more online training resources lastly i would request you to please do like and share this video leave your comments below as i would love to hear from you and subscribe this channel to many more tutorials. Also, press the bell icon to get notifications. I'll be back with another tutorial soon. In the meantime, keep practicing and all the best. Thank you.